tell me who you are and what your company is. I'm Karen Larmer. I'm the Director of Clinical Development for PhysIQ, and we're a company that takes raw biosensor data and uses artificial analytics to create indices for patient conditions and also to determine when a patient's condition is changing. I think that is probably extremely relevant because certainly in the way of the world, we've heard a lot about how excited people are about data, but now there's this new problem of like you want the right data. So uh, I'm not surprised you're here. <laughs> Tell me about um, your expertise expectations of the health tech challenge and what it's been like to be here? Well, um, American Heart Association Scientific Sessions as a whole is a great event because it's a, it's a bi-directional flow of information. I learn a lot about what's going on out there, not only in the clinical space and what the clinical needs are, but also in the technology space. Plus, it's a time for me to network, to have the opportunity to speak to my colleagues and other uh, folks about what we do and get the message out there. It is just a tremendous time for information exchange that honestly you cannot get in any other way. And has there been any insight in particular you've gotten here that's really excited you in terms of how you're going to go home and run your business? Yeah, for sure. Um, I think that there's some validation in that we're moving toward, you know, what do we make out of big data? What do we make out of continuous data that we are on the right track of distilling down what are these events that come out of big data and that our analytics are on the right track for that? I think also um, the validation that there's excitement around um, artificial intelligence and that we are in that right space. And would you recommend applying to the Health Tech Challenge for entrepreneurs in the future, and if so, why? I would definitely recommend applying to the Health Tech Challenge. It's a great um, sort of bar to set for yourself. Um, the American Heart Association is tremendously supportive of new startups and new innovation, and it links you into not only the clinical space, but investors and scientists that can really, in good faith, help you take it to that next level. Thank <laughs> you.